Before we get started, make sure you hit that like button. Also subscribe to my channel and turn on notifications to keep up with all the latest content. Hello guys! I got DJI Mavic Air 2 several months ago and made great videos. In this video I will first talk about cinematic settings and then you will see cinematic videos made by using these settings. First of all, choose MP4 so you can use your recorded file everywhere. Use MOV files only if you are a Mac user. Also choose H265 coding format to save your recordings. The quality is the same as with H264 coding, but with H265 you save space. Anyway, you can play with them to see if there are any difference to you. In my opinion, there are no differences. What about normal and decine like? Normal color option gives you a good look so that editing is not necessary. Decine like doesn't look good when you don't edit it but that's on purpose, so that is basic difference. Normal color option is great for those who would not spend so much time in making videos, but if you want your video to be cinematic, then choose this scene like. This scene like looks flat which gives you the freedom to choose the contrasts, exposure and color. And not only that, it stores more data, so the picture will look better in normal color option. On the bottom right of your main screen when flying your drone, you can find the option to set your resolution and frame rate. You can choose between 4K 2.7K and Full HD in different frame rates and all of the three options in High Dynamic Range or HDR with limited frame rates. I would always recommend using 4K video resolution if you have a decent computer that can edit a lot amount of data 4K has. All my drone videos are in 4K resolution. Of course, you can still lower the resolution to full HD resolution or upscale to 8K resolution afterwards if necessary. General recommendation for frames is to choose 24 frames per second for cinematic video. But if you want greater clarity and if you want to use slow motion, then definitely go with as much higher frame rates as possible. I use 4K resolution with 60 frames per second, except when I'm using HDR mode, which automatically reduces your 4K with 30 frames per second. DJI Mavic Air 2 offers great ISO range, but always use the lowest ISO possible, which is 100. Never go higher than 400 ISO, or your images and videos will have a noise in picture. Shutter speed should always be set inverse double of your frame rate, that means if you use 4K video with 60 frames per second, your shutter speed should be 1 divided by 120. However, if you follow this rule, your images will be overexposed if you do not use ND filters. They came for free with Mavic Air 2 for basic use. Also, 
white balance is something to play with to get great image. There is no the best option for all settings. Generally, for sunny recordings, go somewhere between 5600 and 6000. Finally, recording with your drone has several options. Close to objects, far away to see bigger picture, upside down, reveal, follow and orbit. Enjoy!
Thank you for watching. Keep track for more videos soon. Please like, share and don't forget to subscribe and click that bell button down below.